Hey everyone, this is me Khaled and my last video I shared with you how to create uh, a rubber ducky uh, alternative using uh, Raspberry Pi Pico uh, to use it to load the um, uh, long script that we can run inside the game script application. Um, some people doesn't have this Raspberry Pi Pico and might not be able to get it. Uh, fortunately, uh, we have another way to run uh, such a scripts uh, from the Xbox. So it, it seems that Microsoft has hasn't rolled out the update yet to patch the exploit and uh, This is like reported by Emma carrot cake until now to that moment, which is uh, until the video have been um, published uh, This is as of um, January uh, Sorry, June 11th um, at um, 9.34 p.m. So uh, she mentioned here that the update has still has not been rolled out on Xbox so if you want to bypass the simulated keyboard requirement to load the exploit download this application as well. So uh, it seems that this application is like running or like opening the uh, a way to run this script or like copying the scripts from the USB flash drives or whatever so you can uh, have it a go or like connect through this application so if you still um, like they didn't download the application you still have a chance to go online because this will be a marketplace we cannot like install this application after we go offline so again we need to go back online to uh, download such application we have also other application uh, so we the first one this one that Emma like mentioned the advanced file explorer this is full trust this is like modding and managing documents and stuff like that so I believe this is like a download file explorer like some sort of opening this files to copy it and paste it inside uh, like the game script application uh, also we have one application called uh, notepad T so this is also like a notepad explorer that we can also use it uh, to open the files like we can copy the script and we can paste it uh, inside the, the game script so uh, let's go back to our Xbox uh, one and try to download both application and check from there so i'm back on my xbox here i will try to connect to the network so i'm going to network settings i'm bringing my xbox online so i have here my network and i need to enable it also from my router because i have blocked that also from uh, my, my router to block the access so um I'm connected now. I'm trying to unblock it. So one sec, I am going here. I'm pause the device. This is something internally on my network setup. So if I go back now and test yeah. network connection, it seems that like it constantly connected to the internet. Everything is good. So I can press continue. So let's navigate back to store and first application we'll be downloading is um, the one that Emma said about it which is advanced file explorer so I will come to search and I will start to type at ADV space file and we can see here advanced file explorer going back and then downloading this application so you get it. Okay, get. Got it. So it's installing. Also, it will not harm that we download the other one, which is not bad D and not bad T. So removing all that and going back to not bad T. So we have this application. So we'll come here and. Download this as well. So it's success. We got post application. So check view it in the queue. And we'll wait until it's downloading. So uh, let's switch back to our PC and then um, copy the scripts and put it as a text uh, file. And then we can check it from the Xbox itself. So until this will finish downloading. So let's switch back. And here I will be opening the game script code. So this script that I mentioned or shared before, this was for the rubber ducky file or like uh, payload.dd. But actually we will take 
the normal script which is mentioned here so we'll be highlighting all the code here and then we'll make a copy and then we'll open our xbox media usb we'll create a new file here we'll call it script txt and then we will paste this information and then we will save this file okay so we done that so let's switch back to xbox to check what is the progress so the first file have been downloaded and installed normally okay so we think the second one waiting for a second application and Hopefully that will be downloading and finish also. Meantime, I can remove my Xbox memory stick and plug it on the Xbox itself. As you can see here now it's recognizing that there's a memory stick like a media USB drive um, as we expecting. So let's launch the first application and we'll check from there. So if we open now advanced file explorer like this advanced file yeah advanced file explorer um, so let's take a bit of the load give it some time Because this is the first launch. Yeah, okay. So we have the application. You can move the um, left stick to navigate and you can open it by that. So let's go to the memory. We have here this memory. Try to open that. Documents. I think it should. Let's open that here. So it's mentioned here the removable device. Okay, this device. So we have this removable devices. Yeah, we have here our memory, so it's like that one. So we open that. So we have here the script, so we can open this. Um, yep. It seems it's opening. So one. Once we open it's like mentioned here because the, the two applications have been open now so we have that one and have that one. So we can open it with this advanced file explorer. Let's try this one first. And we should expect the file itself to open. I'm not sure what is the issue here. So it might be something related to advanced script. Let's switch back to the other application, which is Notepad T. We open it with that. Okay. So as you can see here, is this is all the script that we have copied from this application. Um, let's try to search for something to select all. Yeah, we have here something, select all. And then we can come back here and also make... Um, this is, I believe, the copy one. So we'll make copy. And then... We can switch to our game script application. And then we can come here. Uh, unfortunately, we have, I mean, I have the all the script is mentioned, like copied here. So let's try to clear this thing. I'll clean it up. So I need to connect my keyboard. Let's, let's, I will try to connect my keyboard now.
So I'm connecting my keyboard to Xbox and I'm trying to select this code so we can remove it fully. Let's try to add some might come a little bit. I'm trying to get hold on the scripts here. Yeah, so it's showing now the keyboard. So I will control A. I will just delete everything. And I already made a copy there on this application. So let's try to make paste for the code. So let's make paste code. And the application crashed. Let's try this again. So let's open the file, open file. Okay, navigating. So if it's stuck like this, you press the uh, select button and then move to the media. I will go down to the script, opening the file, then we can come back here. This is select all and this is the copy, so we need to just like select all and then go back and make copy. So we copied everything, now switch back to the game script application. Again, we're coming back here, we're trying. Control A, move everything, and then come back up here and try and paste code. So yeah, now it's pasted all the code. Let's try to run this now. So if you go come back here and we can move this game script screen here, and we can switch to the window, which we need to go here windows, and we need to select um, show console window and move this also away. Let's put it here for now and then switch back to windows and then we show the run code window and then we make run code once. So pressing that we need to wait a bit and we should be able to see the results which should be showing this a lot of zeros then one one three six I believe. So we run it. Wait a bit. Yeah, one one uh, one three three seven, sorry. So it seems it's working. So this is a way that you can uh, now do it without even the need of uh, a pico or a pi or whatever uh, this is just direct thing that if you can just with the use of uh, this notepad t uh, file explorer didn't work for us I'm, I'm not sure why maybe it's like extension paste thing so um, maybe uh, emma can share uh, what would be the extension or whatever the um, required to open this game script maybe it have like some dot script app or something like that uh, but we yeah, have for notepad you just like go through the application then you can uh, easily come on the side and make like select all and then you can copy and then you can press the Xbox button, go back to game script and then you can uh, just like choose the, uh, the game script uh, menu here. I mean, that's the window here and then you can make like paste code. Uh, yeah, so that's it for this video. I hope you liked the video. Please, if you do, uh, don't forget to share and leave a like and subscribe also drop your comments down below and i appreciate it for all the uh, recent subscribers that have been uh, done subscribe to my channel and see you on the next one bye for now